Have you misplaced your remote control? Now you may be facing trouble in playing games or watching your favorite shows on Netflix. Have you ever think turning your iPad into a smart TV remote? In a pinch, your trusty iPad can actually be your TV's new best friend. Yes it seems crazy but you can easily do it. There are many ways you can use your iPad into TV remote. In this video I will show you step by step so don't miss any step. The first method is for Apple TV users. You know that your Apple TV remote is sleek and slender which is perfect for vanishing into the depths of your couch cushions. Follow the steps mentioned in this video. And before start make sure your iPad is all updated with the latest iPad OS and it must be hooked up to the same Wi-Fi as your Apple TV or Smart TV. Here are steps. First you have to go to settings on your iPad. Now you have to click on the control center. To add in your control center now you have to click on plus button next to it. Now you have to drag down from top right of your screen to access control center. After getting into the control center you have to go to the bottom right and find a remote shaped icon. After tapping on it you have to select your Apple TV from the device list. To continue you have to unlock your iPad with the 4 digit code. It will pair your iPad to your Apple TV and you can easily control your smart TV volume and continue watching. Second method is using switch control to set up your iPad to control your TV. No worries if your TV is synced with your iPad. Just hook them up using Bluetooth and you're good to go. For this you have to go to settings then go to accessibility and then go to switch control and then switches. Now you have to choose add a new switch and then you have to pick your TV. You must ensure that both your TV and iPad are connected to the same Wi-Fi network. If your smart TV allows then sign into iCloud and also on iPad. Access your apps and utilize your switch to select the device. Then, opt for, use other device, within your switch settings. Now select your iPad and select connect. All done. So these are steps for connecting, using and controlling your Apple TV with your iPad. So now I will show you steps for those people not having Apple TV. You can use a universal remote app that can be easily downloaded via the App Store. I recommend UTV Remote Universal Remote Application whose download link in description. This app is free and compatible with LG, Samsung, Roku, and Sony TVs. After downloading the app the same process will be applied for connecting your smart TV with iPad as I have mentioned before. Once the connection is established, you'll have the power to control features like power, volume, channels, and more seamlessly. You can jazz up your iPad with an interactive widget. You can hook it up with Siri or Apple HomeKit, so you can boss it around with voice commands. Are you a Roku TV user? Then here are the steps for you. If you've got a Roku TV or use a Roku stick, you can actually control it right from your iPad. You have to download the Roku app. When you use your iPad to control your Roku, you can sign into your account seamlessly. It'll actually list out all the Roku TVs that are linked to your account. Then, you can just pick the one you want to use the remote for. With the Roku app on your iPad, you can control each of the Rokus you have and it's like having a remote control for all your Rokus right in the palm of your hand. Thank you so much for watching. Please share and subscribe.